Bera. Bera, ho. Bera, listen to me now. My name is Aradibayo, and here are the top five tech headlines in July. In July, we looked into the most searched words on Google. Buga, Pitobi, Afcon, lit top Google searches by Nigeria in 2022. Let me see you, Buga. Well, that's not the only thing to Buga about in July. In July, the Nigerian Senate passed the Nigerian Startup Bill. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Well, let's hope that our tech ecosystem get to see an improved, improved enabling environment in the near future. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Flutter with discontinuous Butter's virtual dollar card for an extended period of time. But, 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 honestly, but, Flutterweb is not the only African fintech companies that discontinued its virtual card service. Companies like Eversend, GetUkity, Day, and several others also discontinued their virtual card service in July. This means that their users cannot make online payments with their virtual card. That's so heartbreaking. So heartbreaking. Talking about breaking things. Meta is breaking language barriers by introducing a single AI model to translate 200 languages, including 55 African languages. Soon, you will be able to translate on apps like Facebook and Instagram, you know? It's so interesting. Finally, tech innovators discuss challenges with regulations at CAT Summit 2022. The one day event was designed to provide a unique opportunities for key players within the African tech ecosystem to engage with industry regulators on important issues. GAT Summit was hosted by Technes and Ripples. Interesting, right? Innovating, right? Now, to read more innovating tech updates, you should visit Technes.ng and, of course, follow Technes.ng on all their social media platforms. Thank you for watching. My name is Sarah Debayo and see you in September for another interesting, innovating tech update.